Okay, so I'm sorry for any background noise in this one, and I'm sorry, I suck at posting, but I've also been trying to find out really who I am, and I think I jumped into the Neptune name really fast. So, River, that's where I'm staying, that's where I'm most comfortable, and uh, my pronouns have been something I've been trying to figure out for a long time, and at this point... I think I've just decided that I would, I kind of refer to anything. You could call me a he, a she, a they, any neo-pronoun, or whatever you want to call me. I'll respond to it. I'll be fine with it. I don't care. I kind of just don't have preference anymore. I just refer to me as whatever you feel like you want to. And, um, I'll be okay with that. And... You can clearly see this comment is, um, the one I'll be doing today, but, yeah, I have a cousin who age regresses, so this one really stood out to me, and I really wanted to do this one, so, yeah, let's get into this. In no way am I trying to sexualize age regression. And I'm sorry if you hear my sibling and his friend upstairs being loud as heck. I have been trying my hardest not to scream at them. (laughs) I've been trying for 15 minutes now, maybe 20 minutes to post this and they won't shush. So just don't mind any background noises if you hear it. Okay, so... Ray was looking around the house for you. He couldn't find you anywhere. He kept asking around, but no one had seen where you had gone. Norman said he thought he saw you go into the library, but you'd already checked there. So you thought it was about time to check your secret spot. But even Isabella doesn't know of. And she knows about a lot of things. Listener, why are you on the ground with a blanket, a binky, and a baby bottle with, is that milk? Warm milk? What is this about? It's age regression. Oh. I think I've heard of this before. The one where you pretty much become a child mentally and act like a child. Physically, you're still the same age, but it's kind of a coping method and it's kind of different for everyone, but you get what I mean. Yeah? That's what I thought. Wait, but doesn't people who age regress have a cure? Taker, why aren't they here with you? You don't have one. You've been looking to find one and you think you know who it is? Alright, tell me. Me? And Daddy? Um... Is there any particular reason you called me that? As an age regressor, you have many different names you can call your caretaker, mom, mommy, daddy, dad, father, mother, caretaker, whatever is comfortable to them. Couldn't daddy be taken sexually? No, not in a age regressor's head. Hmm, I understand. And you want me to be your caretaker? Yes. <laughs> I'd be more than happy to. If it makes you happy and helps, because you know I love you.
You want to cuddle? Of course. Come here. You like it when I play with your hair? I'm glad. If you ever need me to. Because I'm assuming because I didn't know, you don't want anyone to know you hate your grass. Yeah. If you ever need me to, I can get a warm bottle for you. Oh. A fresh binky or whatever you need. I can get that for you. If it makes you happy and helps keep your thing a secret, I'll be there. I hope this helped in any way to make you feel better about age regressing. I mean, I wouldn't want you to feel uncomfortable, and I know no one in the orphanage would judge you. You just don't want to risk it. Of course, I understand. And you'd like it if I always stayed by your side. Where would I go? I'll always be by your side. I promise. Ray cuddles with you, gets you what you need, and you stay up there for the rest of the night. Isabella knows that you two often disappear to somewhere. She never knows where, though. She tries to follow, but you two quickly find out and end up just sitting in the library until you know for sure that she's gone before entering your secret space. Isabella's tried setting up cameras. And when she did, you two wouldn't disappear. And she would think that she solved the problem. She would leave them up in case it started again. But you two would find a way to break them if she didn't just take them down. And you two would go there every time you needed to regress, or whenever you two just needed to be alone. Also, that's all, but also, um, I was looking for some sort of relaxing music to play in the background, just because it helps me stay focused and it helps block out some of the background noise, but this one was the very first one I clicked on and I fell in love because the tune isn't exactly, but there's similar tunes in this and as there is in like um um just so it, it just it's so similar to Isabella's lullaby and I thought that was a really good fit and I might start using it in the rest of my videos so if you like this um music let me know and if you prefer it without any music in the background i will take it right out i will not put it in there and i hope you all have a great day or night or whatever time it is for you love yourself take care of yourself and be as happy as you can and if you're not happy at all right now it'll come around